In this video, I'm just walking you through how you set up Kartra with your PayPal account. Now, uh, so that I don't disclose any uh, personal financial uh, information, I'm just working off of a documentation page that Kartra gives us. I will put this link uh, in the show notes so that you have it. Basically, you will want to, along the the left side near the very bottom, you will want to click on your integrations. And this is how you integrate Kartra with PayPal and also Stripe or any other payment gateway that you have. Two things that I want to mention straight out of the gate is you do need to have a business account with PayPal in order to get this to work. And then I would go ahead and log into PayPal before you start doing this. The way the directions are here, they have you do some things on Kartra, then they have you go over and log into PayPal. If you just log into PayPal straight out of the gate, it makes it a little easier. So if you're just following the steps here, again, you will go to My Integrations. And then you'll see up at the top here where it's showing integrations. And then when you open that screen, there's all different types of vendors that you can connect to. But if you come up here kind of near the right top and click the drop down arrow, you can say you only want to see the payment integration and that will uh, just give you a small list. And then from there, you will see the PayPal. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then it will tell you, click on the three dots marked up here, and then um, that is going to connect it to PayPal. All right. And then it will, so here's that number one. And then you'll get this little screen here that will connect you to PayPal. So you'll click the three little dots and then you'll also need to it's kind of grayed out you'll click the new integration so basically all you're doing is giving Kartra and PayPal permission to talk to one another that's really all you're doing and then you get this window and you just connect on the button that says connect PayPal and then, <clears throat> excuse me, here it's just telling you again that you have to have a business or premier account in order to grant those transactions. And so then this is the screen that you'll see that once you make that connection with PayPal and you're just saying grant permission. Now there's, you know, different options here. Just leave them all checked and say grant permissions. And then it will take you back to Kartra and Kartra will ask for the PayPal PDT token. Now, what you have to do is you have to go back over to PayPal and get that token. So let me just explain what it is. Each account, and this is why I can't show you on a live account because I can't uh, expose my personal token here. Each account has basically, it's kind of an encrypted code that when people click in order to purchase something, they will uh, be taken to your PayPal account and you'll get the money. So Kartra is looking for that PDT token. So it's, it's very easy to find. So what you need to do Again, just following these directions, open up. I just had two tabs open, my Kartra and my PayPal. So open up or go to the PayPal tab. And up here at the very top right, that little gear shift, you want to click on that and then click on account settings. And then it will open up this window here. Now you may need to scroll down when you get this window open. If you don't see the option that says products and services, you just need to scroll down a little more depending on the size of the screen that you're looking at. And then you want to click on website payments. And when you click on that, then over here in the middle where it says website 
website preferences, <clears throat> you're going to update this because once people click on that button to pay, then you want them to be directed back to your website, your Kartra uh, membership area or, or whatever it is. So you're going to click over here to the far right where it says update. Okay. And then what happens is you will be taken to this next screen here, down here, and it wants to know where to return people. And so all you need to type in over here to the, the right side here is auto return. So in other words, they click on the button to pay. You don't want them just left at PayPal. You want to take them back to Kartra. All you have to type in is HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash Kartra.com. You don't have to worry about your specific account. Kartra will know how to do that and then click the save button. Then there's, um, I think you have to click the save button in order to actually see this identity token. If for some reason you put this in and you click save and you, you're not seeing anything here where it talks about payment data transfer, just try refreshing your screen and see. There'll be that series of numbers numbers and letters like we saw above. And then for the payment data transfer, make sure that it's turned on. So again, we're just giving PayPal the directions that once people pay us, it takes them back to our particular website, our membership or whatever it is. Okay. So here it's just saying that you'll see that long token. So I just highlight it and make a copy. And now going back over to Kartra at that screen that you were left with, paste in that uh, PDT token and then type in whatever your PayPal email address is. So for me, I have a different PayPal address then or PayPal email address than the main one I use for my business. The reason is I had my PayPal account a lot longer than my Star Consulting. So whatever email you use to connect with PayPal is what you put here. You paste in that token that should make this button turn green and you can click it to create it. Okay. Then uh, it seems like a lot, but stick with me. You're almost to the end. Then it's saying instant payment notification. So the third option is it's nice to be notified from PayPal that you have a payment. So this is what these steps are doing. So again, you still have your PayPal tab open. You're going to go back into that and click the little gear shift again to open that up. And this time on the left side here under the uh, business profile, click on notifications. And again, you may have to scroll down a little bit to see this. Click on notifications. And then here, instant payment notifications. We want to integrate PayPal payment notifications with your website. So you want to be notified. So you'll click on that update. And here you just put in the website HTTP colon forward slash forward slash Kartra.com in the notification field. Okay. And then you select receive IPN message enable and click save. So basically just have it exactly like this, make sure that it's enabled and then um, it should save it. Okay. And then uh, it says, on the other hand, if the miss message delivery is disabled or if the screen looks like below, then you need to choose IPN settings. So again, all we're doing is turning the switch on so that when you get a PayPal payment, it will notify Kartra and then Kartra 
will notify you. Okay. And then uh, you just keep on coming down here. And then where it says on the next page at the notification URL, input HTTPS colon forward slash forward slash Kartra.com. Make sure the receive IPN message is ticked on and click save. Okay. So here we don't put your website. We put Kartra.com. Click save and you should be good to go. So I know that's a lot of information. So let me just do a quick recap. In order to get your payments uh, connected with PayPal, you first have to go into integrations on Kartra, tell it you want to set up a payment integration, tell it to connect to your PayPal account, and then we give PayPal permission to talk to Kartra. We grab that PDT token off of PayPal, which it's under here under your account settings. So we grab that token. We also connect it here with the auto return so that it takes people back to Kartra. And then we paste it in here within Kartra, that token. So that, that's the most important step. And then the other two steps is if you want to be notified, which why wouldn't you, then you would go back to PayPal and you would set up your notifications. And then within the notification fields, you would enter the Kartra.com. And then just make sure that you have that IPN setting turned on. And then you save it and you're good to go. And then at that point, you are ready to start receiving money from PayPal. And in another video, I'll talk about how you connect to your Stripe account.